Hi, I would like to show the current state of Conquer Chess, Battle for Liberty, because I'm just going to change how the game works. So if you take a look at the game now, you can see that pieces move. Um, but what we can see is now that, for example, it would take one game time for the queen to move from here to here. Um, whereas at the same time, at the moment, a pawn can do two moves. So this should change that we can play a real chess game uh, within the same time units. So now we can do a lot of things. Also during movement we can do other things. Um, so, uh, so also a pawn for example moving two squares forward um, should take one game move. Whereas moving it twice forward for one square should take two moves. Um, and that's not the case yet. So to allow, uh, and, and that's, that was a fun idea, but I want to get closer to real chess, that they can play real chess games in Conquer Chess um, with the same chess game units. So for example, a scholar's mate should be able to be done in a game time of four chess moves. Also, also what happens now is a capture. And so let's make this queen attack this. So now the queen is attacking the pawn, and after capture, it uh, this will this will take ten uh, chess game units. That's too slow, and also the capture. It, uh, so the queen moves there, uh, and that also takes another two units. So so for example, and also you can undo it, and that's not unlike chess. So in chess, if you capture a move, if you capture a piece, uh, you you get th you you are there. For example, this bishop, um, I can just uh, make it go back. So what I'll be doing is when um, when a piece does the kill shot on another piece, it will be teleported there instantaneous. Um, so attacking will take you one uh, chess game move time instead of ten, and when you do it, you get teleported there. All right. So that's all I wanted to show about. Um, the game for now and uh, I wish you a very good day. Bye!